lot, a lot of youngsters out there for you today. That, what, what, who, which of the young guys were you most impressed with? Well, you know, I, I it's it's too early to tell. I'm just I'm just excited that we have a lot of young guys and a lot of good young guys to work with. So we've got a long way to go, but uh, we've got a good attitude and, and a good group of guys to work with. When you come in kind of late as you did. Do you stay up all night watching the game tapes, or what? Do you, what's your approach to learning what you have in the hand you've been dealt? Well, really, uh, what I did was, uh, you know, I came in here and talked to these guys a, a couple of weeks ago, and uh, one of the things I did on that visit was just kind of take a look at some of the guys that were here, just so I had an idea what was here. The returning guys. Yes, I yeah. really hadn't had a chance to look at the freshmen. I've just actually started to look at those guys, but uh, I, I would, I would just assume. Uh, go with a blank slate. Do you have to ask them to wear name tags this first week? I've asked, I've asked them to, uh, in meetings to uh, wear their numbers, their jerseys, <laughs> so I know who they are. And, uh, you know, they've been great about it. I told them, I said, you know, there's, there's a lot more of you guys than there is me. And I said, I'm learning, I'm learning you, you, you six guys, or, or it's eight guys I have, and then uh, I'm learning everybody else because everybody else walks up to me and says hello. So it's 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 kind of hard, but that's to be expected. It, it'll it'll take a, a couple of weeks, but I'll get it down. You've coached a lot in college and a lot in the NFL. Mm -hmm. When you come back to college, what do you have to remember that's different, and how do you approach things, uh, or do you approach things differently? Uh, well, it, it might be a little bit different just because uh, these guys here are really, uh, they're coming from high school, they're, they're first time away from home, uh, and so they're a little bit younger, just, you know, a lot of, a lot of follow-up on just things, making sure they're at meetings on time, understanding what they got to do, uh, and then uh, fundamentals and techniques, they, their base is probably not as good as those guys that we, you know, we, we had in, on Sundays. How tough is it for... Uh for you to come in with a, uh, into a new situation with uh, so many new DBs and you're going up against one of the top quarterbacks of the country and a veteran group of wide receivers. I wouldn't have it any other way. It's going to make us better. If we, can, if we can do well against this group, we're going to be all right. What are your early impressions of the talent base and just the program in general coming in? Excuse me? What are your early impressions of the talent base around you and out of the program in general coming in? Well, uh, I... I you know, I don't have any other colleges to compare it to, uh, you know, recently. And so uh, there is a lot of skill out here uh, that I can see. Uh, I think we have a very good-looking receiver group. And, you know, there's, there's a couple of guys in the back end that have a chance. Uh, I don't know where we are with the front guys as far as if we got a dominant rusher or, or what. I know that those guys are a lot better than they were last year. So... That, that is helpful. So I just really don't have a lot of basis to put that on right now to answer your question. John, I, I, we were told that you don't want to talk about your situation with the Eagles the last year. Well, I, I just I just really uh, I want to move forward from that I, because what I don't want to do is, is open the gate for Chip Kelly questions, okay? Chip was wonderful to me. It was a great place. He, he does a wonderful job there, and he's a great coach. And I'll just leave it at that, okay? You, you had a, I guess, they assigned you to do pro scouting. Yes. Did you just have the itch to still coach guys? Uh, that's part of it, but, uh, you know, the situation here was, was very good. It was, uh, I'm, I'm back with a, a very good friend of mine. And, uh, you know, he told me that the working conditions here, I'm talking about Coach Dykes, just none better. So coming from that, I said that was one of the reasons I was interested in staying in Philadelphia because it was, it, uh, the situation in the building was great. It was very comfortable. It was wonderful. So I, I loved it there. And that's what, that's what made uh, that stay there very good. Um, you know, this is a hard job no matter where you are. If uh, if the environment that you work in is good, then it's uh, it's a lot of fun. Your association with Art, though, is that what got you back here to some degree? Well, he was the first guy that started, and you know I, I can trust I can trust things that he says because I've worked very closely with him several places, and uh, you know having him having said that made a world of difference. What did he tell you about what you were going to walk into? Well, he, I mean, I knew I was walking into a little bit of a hornet's nest, but, uh, you know, I wouldn't be walking into it if, if it was, uh, you know, uh, on top of the world. It wouldn't have been available to you. Uh, yeah. Probably not, you know, right. just uh, don't, have, don't really have any idea. But my point is, is uh, you know, it's, it's much improved from what it's been. 
Uh, they've got more, more numbers uh, of guys that have a chance to play and help us. And so, you know, I was optimistic to come in here and, and try to coach them up and, and, and help them get some plays. A lot of your guys are new, but for the guys who are returning and who have been through the last couple of years when they had such a tough time, do you have to mend psyches at all? Or do you, how do you get them to turn the page on that stuff? Well, we just, it's clean slate. We're just starting right now from day one. I told them today in the meeting, uh, you know, we have no history. You have no history, so we're just, you know, going from this day forward. What you do from here on defines who you are and how I treat you and et cetera. You had a similar uh, rebuilding job at Texas Tech in 2012, right? Was it, is yes. this tougher or is that tougher? Uh, well, I, I think right now we're, we are probably a little bit ahead of where we were when we walked into Tech. All right, you guys good? Thanks. Okay. Yeah, Thanks a lot. Okay. Thanks, All right. Thank Welcome. you. Okay. Good job.